Hello folks and welcome back to Robocop Rogue City. Rogue City? Rogue City. Where last time we were in the precinct and did some paperwork and helped out with the front desk and now we are hitting the streets looking for soot. Search for soot's whereabouts over there apparently. Do you have a map? I want to say M on reflex and we do have a map. Of, of, of an area. We can go, ooh, let's, 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 let's do the thing. It wants us to go that way, we're gonna go this way. Well, can you drive back? Is it just straight up we can just go back to the precinct? No. Well, not yet, anyway. But that is just hell. I was wondering if something like if, 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 if a letter got broken off. I guess there's space for maybe an O to have fallen off there. Can't go down there. Hello. Open 24 hours, huh? Doesn't look open 24 hours. Glowing handprints. No pain, no smoking. It's hissing. Lovely. Stomping on down. Murphy, this is Reed. Mayor Kuzak just stormed into my office. Apparently, his niece's car has been stolen. Find it. This goes to the top of your priority list. You can start by asking about it at some of the local garages. For the record, it's a blue SUX 6000, registered to Melissa Kuzak. Okay. So already we're we're we're, uh, we're bypassing proper procedure by just doing favors. The shoes I found in the dumpster behind the mega store. I got like your glasses. Fifteen bucks for them. Shh, quiet. Unless you want to lose them. Oh, skill point. Yes. Uh, can keep working on. We're going to keep working on deduction because deduction is going to give us more experience from notes. And the scanning lets you detect more helpful information such as a safe combination or discover hidden objects or rooms. Please. Is there any reason why I should turn off my scanning at any moment? Just toggle it on and leave it on forever. Oh, hello. We found. Is this an SUX? I'm trying to remember what they look like from the movies. Hello, citizen. Hey, I might be a little late filing my tax returns, but sending a one-man army seems like an overreaction. I am here to investigate the theft of a blue SUX 6000 that belongs to Melissa Kuzak. Fancy car and fancy name. But I hardly ever get the pleasure of dealing with either. Do you have any information about the whereabouts of this vehicle? To be honest, I did some work on one of those cars recently but I can assure you that it was not the one you're looking for. Do I have your permission to search the shop? I know what the world's like, but can a man go about his business without being harassed all the damn time? Ooh. <laughs> That's not my intention. I do not mean to obstruct anyone's work, but fulfilling my duties takes priority. Then why aren't you out there on the streets where a real crime is happening? Instead of badgering hard-working citizens. Is car theft not a real crime to you? You know what? If you really think you'll find evidence of that SUX ever being here, then be my guest. Really? Oh, okay, fine. I thought we were going we to get a fine. Okay, sure. Let me hear. Second material. Kind of toolbox irrelevant to the case. Car batteries. Engineering level 2 required. Interesting, I can't scan that. I have I don't know what those are without it, but oh interesting. Uh, those notes I can pick up? Any material? Our service ducks are all into the case. Calculation shows tax records. Really? I'm gonna I mean I'm not surprised. But we're gonna use his tax records to Bully him into saying something. I mean, no. See, I told you, you'll find Jack all, because there ain't nothing to be found. This place is legit. 
63% of your repair invoices have not been accounted for. You've gone over my books? I thought you came here looking for the car thief. Looks like there is more than just one thief to be caught. Oh, come on. This is how everyone operates in this godforsaken city. Cut me some slack, will you? Okay, you win. So there's this boy. And he's literally not paying my salary. He works for me on and off. He might have something to do with the missing car. Let me open his locker for you. Like, OCP, oh, I don't think I even get paid wages, so an OCP Go pays the police, so as long as the taxes are going to the police. Right, to car theft tools. You reckon? Is he your man? For the time being. Where is the suspect? You see, he hasn't turned up for work for some time. This morning, when two thugs swang by looking for him, I knew he must be in trouble. I've overheard him many times talking about a place where he does car jobs on the side. Give me the precise location. I can't tell you exactly where it is. All I know is that it's one of the garages near the local storage compartments. Tell me about Scott. Tell me why you think he is responsible. He's young, bright, and would like to rule the world. I get it. But nearly every month, he gets himself in trouble. It is not enough to make assumptions. I'm not a cop, but I've seen many things in my life. And where there's smoke, there's usually fire. Scott doesn't work here full time? Is he a temporary worker? You could say that. We fall out a lot because he brings a lot of hot stuff to the shop, and I'm not okay with it. And you let him come back? It's hard to make an honest living these days. That's why I understand his struggle, and I let him come back. Working here keeps him out of trouble. And to be frank, it's not easy to find such a good mechanic either. They're doing the, the thing I don't enjoy about certain games like this, where you don't say the line that you're clicking on. I clicked on, Scott doesn't work here full time, and then RoboCop said, is he a temporary worker? That's not what I clicked. And so no, whenever those things happen, you get, a, you get a real disconnect about what happens then. I'm just going to go. That is all for now. Hey, make sure no harm comes his way. He might have done some foolish things in the past, but he's a good kid, and he deserves another chance. A court of law will be the judge of that. Mm. I have not got many hopes. Right. Okay, I can't go where I'm looking. I'm going... I'm over here. Is it, there's a ladder? You know what? There is a ladder. I'm surprised I can hold my weight. Um, ooh. Notes, 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 notes. Yeah. No, oh, pictures. Incriminating pictures from up here? <gasps> Is there fall? Does, does Robocop suffer fall damage? We're about to find out. We're about to find out if, if how good the shock absorbers on these legs are. Well, not in a non-combat setting, at least. Would have been cool if I'd left if I left cracks in the pavement. That would have been interesting. Three hundred pounds seems too light for Robocop. Oh, we gun out. Are we gun out? Oh, hello. No hard feelings. Yo, kid. Boss is not impressed that. With what you do to that SUX, but he's a reasonable guy and will let you keep your nimble fingers as long as you show up in the, in the chop shop before nightfall. Okay, so Scott's in trouble. Again, surprising nobody. Anything here I want? Not as such. Anything here I want? Oh, you want me to go this way or that way? No, you want me to go that way, okay. So nothing in here, friend. Are you breaching? We're just gonna walk inside. We're just walking inside. Hey Scott. You must be Scott. 
What did you do with the blue SUX6000 that you stole? Hey, well, why would I have anything to do with that? I have found evidence in Ben's shop. You can't possibly help me. I don't want to cause any more trouble, especially for Ben. Mm. Directions of consequences. Our actions affect people around us. Do you mean Ben? Shit! Is he alright? Is Ben okay? Please tell me. I would never forgive myself if anything bad happened to him. During our conversation, my health monitor did not detect any trauma as yet. Okay, okay. Wow, well, that means threatening violence? It was me who jacked the SUX, but he didn't leave me any choice. Who is he? I can't tell you. If he knew I gave him away, He'd take revenge on Ben. Oh God, it must be those thugs. We're dead. No one is going to save us. What are you talking to, Scott? If they are criminals, then they are the ones who need saving. Hello? Anybody home? Where are you, Scotty boy? You can only hide for so... Oh, shit. It's the metal pick. Okay. Eliminate threats. I'm still eliminating threats or are you going back to Richard Scott? Squish. Z. I, I, did, I just saw the button for time for a slow time. Okay. You did it! They didn't think that through. Maybe you can put an end to this after all. I am missing vital information in order to resolve this case. I'll tell you what you want. Just please, help me fix this screw-up. Where is the car now? Oh man, I'm sure it's still in their chop shop. It's a warehouse on the northeast side. The entrance is concealed, but I'm sure you'll find it. I'm no fighter, but if there is any other way, I would like to help. Maybe you need some more intel. Who is responsible? Who did you mean by him? It's Rex, from the local gang. I only did petty jobs for him mostly, but this time he made me steal that car. He said he wanted the SUX 6000 we were repairing at Ben's. When I said it was too hot, he slashed me with his knife. Why were you hiding? I'm going the same you line. You saw those thugs. They were looking for me. They realized I tricked them. They wanted the SUX 6000 from Ben's shop, but I didn't want to get him into trouble, so I stole a different one. I doubt anyone would have given a shit, but word on the street is that it belongs to the mayor's niece. <laughs> Any criminal matters should be reported to the police. I know. I just thought I could figure this out by myself. Ben was right from the start. I shouldn't have gone down this road. Right, anyway. That is all for now. Proceeding to the vehicle's estimated location. You are calling for backup, aren't you? Negative. Threat calculation minimal. Right. Go to the chop shop then. Again, I really shouldn't leave you here with all these guns on the ground, but I guess... Whatever. We should really be collecting, and, or at least uh, destroying the firearms as we get them. That's what, that's search for suits. So we're gonna go back, I uh, can go forward here, and turn left and go straight. And I'll, I'll, I'll start running just because... Robocop is slow. You get to a nice little, little jog here. The wash and go is open. You graffiti, do I, do I get points for stopping you or something? Ah! Citizen, I am ordering you to discontinue this deliberate act of vandalism. S screw you, man! Am I chasing him? I am chasing him. Fine. Oh heavens, they're footprints. Imagine my surprise. Hmm? 
That's going to result in size 10 of the traces of paint. Oh. Highlighted from a world away. Like the, those are the those are, anyway, if, I go, if I go back here real fast. Yeah, there's a foot there's a footprint here. Footprint's here. Let's see how, how yeah, after this point it's impossible to follow it. I wish it was cool if you could have followed it without using RoboVision. That would have been interesting. Like Robo Project is there to help you out if you need it, but you could have done it without it because the, the footprint's actually still there. It says traces of paint, doesn't it? Hello. So what, what, what you gonna do? You you can't put me behind bars. I, I'm still a kid and only done it once. J just let me off with a warning, will ya? Mm -hmm. It is my duty to warn you not to commit that or any violation again. Yes, sir. <laughs> Thank you. I, I'll do my best not to get caught again. You said that I inspired the graffiti artist. Okay. That may come back to cause future problems. Anything in the wash and go? Ooh. Notice. If I catch any of you dope heads washing jelly beans or marbles just for kicks, I'll make you pay for the parts you wrecked. That makes sense. Ooh, another note? What? Dad, tell me the truth. Are we poor? Dad? Dad! Tired of your kids asking annoying questions? You just want to relax after a long day of work, but someone won't let you? Are we going to be okay? Dad, I'm scared. Snoozers. Sleeping pills for kids. Just one pill can guarantee you five <laughs> hours of peace. The name of the subtitle is wrong, just correct. became your decision. Sleep tight, son. I'm tired. Because you deserve a peace of mind too. I mean, honestly, if you could do that, if you genuinely had like a, a, a medicine that, that for no side effects could guarantee like you have five hours, no more, no less, you'd probably make a lot of money with that. Officer. Hello, Detroit citizen. Let's go deal with the chop shop. Road closed. Are they making uh, Delta City? Has Delta City been made? I can't remember. This is a bit, this is after two. Delta City hasn't been is maybe still in the process of being built. Okay, there's a chop shop down there. Nothing untoward out here, at least. Probably massive firefight inside. That's probably how that's going to go. Got a bang bang shoot shoot. Uh huh. Service board. Brand. Change program. I'm investigating things, am I? Okay. Oh, fools. Fine. Two prints lead to a wall. Possibility of hidden evidence. Find the way in. Someone stood here. Someone stood here. Can I just punch my way through the wall? It's Robocop. Robocop punches his way through the wall. Pick up the bike. Oh, 
on, I can pick up the bike. Those look mean musty graphics. That, is, that might be a graphic setting thing. I'm running, some, I'm running some DLSS to get performance up, but I maybe should just turn it off and see how it does normally without messing around with stuff like that. Pictures. Reloading them. Go to nine. I hope this is not the uh, stolen SUX because I just blew up a lot of stuff here. Um. I want to give them. I want to give them the, the, the bike, though. Okay. One more OCP healer. Again, I don't think there, sh there shouldn't be any healing kits over here. They don't make any sense to be healing kits over here, but I do want one. Uh, ooh. Again, not sure that's there, but sure. More documents. Anything else in here? Ooh, hello. You all. Seven. Oh god, I have, to, I have to type this out. Really? Hang on, fine. Let's make a note of this. In case it's relevant, I'm not sure how relevant it's going to be, but 7x573x68x21x x34x28. Move the gun, please, Robo. Thank you. 96XX73. No idea how relevant that's going to be, but we'll find out in due course. Is there a. Is there a safe in here? No. Safe might be upstairs then. Uh, ladder's up there. That'll be my uh, enhanced deduction skills. So, handbag, thank you. Do those. Th th does that evidence give me, like, points now, or does it give me points later? I wonder. Uh, guns, a bunch of 9 mil. Clump, 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 clump. Mark SMG. Cool. The safe. Right, okay. Open the safe engine level 6. We have the... You can open the safe without. Like, in general, level six, you open the safe without a code. But there's a co there was something downstairs, code-wise. Fuse box. What was that code for? I wrote it down. It was all like highlighted and stuff. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go over there because they, they want me to go that way. So I'm gonna look. Let's look what's over there then. What was that code for? Get an entrance over there. Can I just punch through the wall? Yes. Bunch of new console and jewelry. Oh. Again, I think experience for evidence comes at the end as a lump sum. Which is annoying. Um. What the, what's that code for? I want to know. I was assuming it was something to do with it. With the, uh, it doesn't look like a code for a, for a safe. A computer code, maybe? Thank you. No, to the safe combination. That is not what I wrote down. Um, but hopefully this works with the safe upstairs. 
I was definitely looking at it with my vision before, so it didn't work out. Thank you. Must remember, I have slow, slow motion. Gotta remember I've got slow motion. Be relevant in some stuff. Right, hello you. Fake money, fake money, fake money. I'm gonna say, what, what, what am I gonna use in the safe for? I don't care about crap about money, it's just evidence. What do you do? Recharge. Vitality level 2 required. Noted! Getting getting level two and everything will probably be very nice very nice. I might I might sort of juggle deduction and everything else. I press the button. That's the SUX six thousand. Oh that's just fine of the car. I thought, was, I, thought, I thought we were getting it for a final fight. I guess not. I guess the final fight was in the office. You <gasps> the bodies, they're gone. In the in mint condition. Ah, uh, again, eighties retro futurism cars. That's why. Ooh, a Tech Nine. I think I've ever seen one of these in the game first before. Keep it around for a while. Although, again, using an unlicensed weapon, not supposed to be happening. How much experience am I get for this? Ooh. Am I gonna get? I'm gonna get a full. I can't believe you've like, actually done it. I can't even. Do you think I could take that car back to the owner and say I'm sorry? Maybe she won't press charges. This car is now in police custody. Oh please, I could really use a helping hand right now. Otherwise, I'm back in juvie. <sighs> I'm gonna trust you here, Scott. I'm gonna trust you. Proceeding to secure the perimeter. Keys are in the ignition. Thank you so much! I promise I won't mess this up! Well, vehicle, I got a bunch of experience. Okay, chop shop. What time is it? 27. Um, let's keep going around. Let's keep going towards where this listen for soot stuff is. If you come across anything else, you won't have to wander around then because clearly you can just come across quests by walking around. We had two, uh, one quest walking around here. We got a couple of quests in the police station just by wandering around. Sorry, so, I'm so sorry. <laughs> just walked over your head there. Which for Robocop must be very unpleasant. Um, not for Robocop, but for, for you, something weighing up that much over your head must be very unpleasant. Cat. Does Robocop have a relationship with cats? I cannot remember. I watched one and two recently. Like I think when when I knew this game was coming out and I played the demo, I, I rewatched one and two. Cool. Oh yeah. There's a one thing that surprised me. Like, like Robocop two, I think was written by Frank Miller. The, the screenplay. I was like, really? Okay. Way before things like three hundred and. Um, what was it, Frank? He did 300 and he did. Ooh, bottles? Is it just for throwing? Ooh, no, it's, it's a thing. A scannable thing. Hello. Drinking in public. Oh, for God's sake. Honestly, I don't care. Public drinking is against the law. Public? But this is my private sofa. I've dragged it all the way from the junkyard. I see your point. I will let you go this time, but remember that drinking in an unsuitable environment can lead to severe consequences. Well, that's the whole point. <laughs> so clearly, there's like there's like a public trustometer because it even mentions it in the um, in psychology. Doubles earned public trust points. So at some point, maybe we have to like will the public side with me or not? Which means there's. Can I can I expect like a like a a moment of like how have you been doing this far? Does the public like you? 
kind of situation. That's what I'm inferring from the existence of Hoods. Not in this market. We're looking at an annual return of 9.2% if you diversify your portfolio based on the volatility report. Deferred profit shares are where it's at. Trust me, I know what I'm talking about. But, uh, but you're homeless. Because he doesn't know what he's talking about. I'm assuming the joke there is that um, homeless investor was really bad at investing, therefore lost all their money. I was going to jump over that, and like, no, Robocop doesn't jump. I cannot crouch, and I cannot jump. Control does nothing, C does nothing, space does nothing. No jumping, no crouching. Ben? Are you still here? Can we have a chat with you, Ben? No? Okay, fine. So maybe you have a chance to say, no, we got Scott out, whatever, whatever. Scott's fine. Nope, no. No re-engaging. No re-engaging. Right, folks, I think we'll carry on next time, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye.